Hey guys, it's Dan from DisneyInfinityCodes.com, and I am here uh, after a fun-filled day at the New York Comic Con in Manhattan, New York. And um, I am back from the Disney Infinity Marvel Battlegrounds panel, where we got some great first looks at some gameplay, some awesome artwork, uh, and details all about Marvel Battlegrounds. Uh, it was a really fun panel. Um, and uh, I'm sure you've watched it on live stream. You can check the details about it on our site. Um, but one of the things I did was hand out a uh, Hulkbuster figure to all the folks in attendance. Um, there was a really great moment where uh, they were going to uh, just give a figure to the uh, the section of the audience who um, who corresponded to one of the four people up on stage playing the live demo in a four-player battle. Uh, but... Um, uh, I think it was just a ruse, and then there were shenanigans with one of the controller's batteries dying in the middle of the fight. So uh, my section probably would have won if the batteries didn't die. But uh, but anyway, so uh, but you know, hey, we still got all of our Hulkbusters, and it's a super fantastic figure. First thing is, it is a heavy figure. You can hear the 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 thump. Uh, it is probably the heaviest figure I have seen in this game. I cannot believe how dense and heavy this figure is. Um, but uh, let's open them up and take a close look. So here's the, the packaging here. Put the Hulkbuster on there. Got him in there. He is snug in there. He is nice and tight. Uh, they used up all the available space they could to get this figure in there. Uh, there's the bottom. Oh, turn around and take a peek at the back. Um, so uh, this is an interesting thing because um, he is available to play inside the Marvel Battlegrounds uh, playset, but they don't have that on the compatibility. Uh, I don't even know if they maybe even have the uh, Marvel Battlegrounds playset icon to even put here. So we'll have to see. Um, <clears throat> we'll read here. It says Hulkbuster. Iron Man's Hulkbuster armor can withstand the Hulk's mightiest blow. Um, and then here is a peek at the uh, the lineup that they have on the packaging so far. Um, you can see Ultron and Hulkbuster there, in uh, you know with all the other figures, uh, including the old uh, 2.0 Captain America. Um, so uh, I think that what JV was saying about how the Captain America, the first Avenger, was added to the lineup uh, is true because uh, they probably would have had already had him on the packaging had he not already been um, had he not been added uh, to the lineup. Um, that they originally had planned for uh, Marvel Battlegrounds. So um, it's because he's not on the back. So uh, let's um, let's open this guy up and take a peek inside. Man, it's a big figure. It's like look at the the the, the bubble the, the wrappings on this compared to compared to most of the other figures. It is big. Um, so of course we've got the uh, don't choke on me, you know, those kind of instructions there. Take this box and toss it over here to the side. Uh, <clears throat> got the Hulkbuster um, power disc, uh, uh, power, boy, it has been a long day, web code. Uh, and we can take a peek at the back here. There it is. Uh, there it is in the back. So that's exciting. We'll be giving this away on uh, the website, DisneyInfinityCodes.com, so make sure you visit. And, uh, let's jump in here and get this. Man, that is one big figure. All right, let's get a close-up on this guy here. All right, so here is... The Hulkbuster. Let me get, change the lighting a little bit here so we can. Perfect. So he is a big. Um, you can see the base there is uh, um, a new base. Um, I'm not like the other ones. Um, also, uh, from the looks of the photos, different from the new Captain America uh, base as well. But it's got like some rubble and you know some damaged uh, walkway there. Um, Possibly uh, from the, uh, the town of Wakanda, where you see um, the Hulkbuster featured in the film. But um, there's some really, really great detail in this care in this figure here. Just do a nice little spin. Hulkbuster, of course, is a flying figure, and so that's where you get these. Uh, these little thrusters here on the back. 
uh, you can fly with the Hulkbuster, which is pretty great. And um, here you go. He's got a, you know, his arc reactor there. I believe he's got. Um, you, I don't think you can, they're not on the arms, but I think he has an arc reactor in each of the of his limbs uh, because of the suit being so massive. But um, I'm trying to remember correctly from the film. It's been a while since I've seen it. Uh, but um, but he's got some really really great detail um, all over. Really great paint job. And boy, is he heavy. Look here at the base. So I, I, I went and grabbed uh, the Hulk from my collection to kind of do a side-by-side -side to show you how much larger he is even compared to the Hulk. Because the Hulk is a pretty big figure. Um, and, uh, and he towers over the Hulk. And he's much larger. Um, although it's hard to really get a, a solid representation uh, because video only shows you so much depth, uh, he is definitely much heavier and much uh, much larger than the Hulk here, uh, but not by much because the packaging is still the packaging. So, um, so there you go, guys. There is the Hulkbuster from Disney Infinity 3.0's new playset, Marvel Battlegrounds, which was just previewed today in New York Comic Con, and. Um, Thanks for watching, and visit us at DisneyInfinityCodes.com. And um, you know what? Because I've got this, uh, and uh, it's still going to be a month until everyone else can get it. This, I think, this week we'll give we'll give this Hulkbuster away too. And so um, you can get this Hulkbuster figure before any of your friends. Uh, and so just visit us DisneyInfinityCodes.com in our giveaway section, and we can uh, you can win a Hulkbuster figure. Thanks for watching, guys.